so now this is the part where I get to sing. What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? Ba da 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 da. That's good. Not bad. Not bad. That's pretty good. I feel. I feel. <laughs> oh, I forgot my musical <laughs> instrument. Yeah. Uh, next. I got a. I got a uh, ocarina from. You really? from uh, no yeah, way. I'm thinking you have an ocarina? for free using my uh, GameStop power up points because I've never used them before. I didn't even know they existed. <laughs> like, hey, you have thirty five thousand points. Wouldn't it be awesome if Jesus, you started playing? Thirty five thousand points. That How doesn't many get you, you anything. Get game? I think it's like it's like ten thousand bucks or like ten bucks. It's like the cash transfer oh, okay. thing. But <laughs> they, like they did a thing. All the, and all the crap that they have with their stores really really crappy. Um, but they had a collaboration with ThinkGeek, so you can use it to buy ThinkGeek stuff. So cool. I bought a ceramic blue ocarina. It has it, like a Triforce symbol on it. And you can play it. Yeah, I can play it because little. Does a horse show up when you play it? No. Awesome well, you everything. have to play the right song, bro. I did go back seven years, it's though. That was like, kind of cool. I think it's right down up, right down up. That's how <laughs> you go, right? <laughs> Yeah, that's cool. All right, well, since you're talking, why don't I you go ahead and start? Tell me what that. you're doing. What uh, you doing I've been about? practicing on my ocarina. <laughs> <laughs> All day. Feeling oh. pretty, pretty good. Did um, you guys ever spend time playing actual songs with the ocarina? On no, I, I couldn't do it because you can like make the pitch different by moving the yeah. thumbstick. It was just too hard. No, they there was like a lot. I played some songs. I played some music on there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know Mario Paint. I tried to make music. Do you remember that back in the day? Oh yeah. Uh, There's like SNES. YouTube videos of people doing Mario Paint like hardcore, like playing Queen and stuff like that. It's pretty <laughs> awesome. It's really good. Too. Yeah. Speaking of SNES, there you go. Uh, Segway. Segway. I'm building something. I've been looking for a, like a cool techie like project with something to do with my hands for a while now. I'm building a Game Boy. It's uh, called a Game Boy Zero. Shout out to uh, pseudomod.com. Check it out. I'm sorry, something funny, David. <laughs> no, I don't just, know what happened. Just, that was so funny, David. <laughs> <laughs> you know, this, this guy built it, and he didn't have any obligation. He just you know put it out on YouTube, and a lot of people were really interested on how to build this. And he's putting very step by you know detailed step by step tutorial on how to build this thing. And what does it do? Really cool. Okay, so it's a Game Boy. It's an original yes. Game Boy case, and you um, shell it out, everything, and you put a Raspberry Pi Zero, which is a computer. It's a little tiny computer. Like the this. Raspberry Pis are sweet. Yeah, but they came on the new one called Raspberry Pi Zero, and they're like this big by this big. By yay, by yay. Yeah, sorry, audio guys. It's really small. Um, That's what she said. <laughs> sorry, go ahead. <laughs> but anyway, it's really cool. Uh, you can load a bunch of emulators on it for like SNES, Genesis, um, regular Nintendo, Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, obviously. I think that was the point I was laughing. They're, You're giving shout out to the guy who's like violating all of Nintendo. He but, probably owns all these games. I know, but it's just funny. You're like, hey, shout out. Anyways, that's why I laughed. But go ahead. Keep going. Lawyers. <laughs> <laughs> Jerks. All of them. They ruin everything. I know. We do. They we really do. do. No, anyway, but, um, I, <laughs> but uh, I, I saw the video. You can like you can play everything, right? Yeah. Even, there's Doom ports. There's Quake ports. That's super there's cool. There's all sorts of cool stuff on it but uh, i carved out the case and everything the other night it was up to like three o'clock in the morning uh friday night where I did put you in find the, the original buttons. game boy uh, i bought it off ebay oh okay i bought a broken one because you don't want to tear apart a perfectly good working game boy because <laughs> yeah, you're not gonna need all the parts shame. anyway yeah but um i'm pretty much done with all the hardware modifications now it's just uh programming and getting all the buttons mapped and all that cool stuff every so. time you destroy a game boy that works mario gets a little tear <laughs> 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 but hopefully i should have it done next week maybe i'll bring it on the show next yeah, week for sure. and we can play a little bit but that's gonna play all that. Just make Where did you sure get the you screen? Is the screen the original it. Game Boy Color screen, or is that part of the no, Raspberry Pi? No, it's a three and a half inch. I uh, got it off of a. It's a TFT monitor you can use for like backup cameras and stuff. Oh, okay, gotcha. That's the screen that it actually. Okay, very cool. And then so it's it's how do you have to solder anything? Yeah, that you have to solder. There's a there's a the PC buttons. board for the buttons that you solder to a tiny thing called a Teensy. Yeah, and that wires into the the pie for you know input and all that now how many buttons are on it because you can play snes so it's kind of yeah have... so i i drilled the own uh xy buttons so those a b x y obviously selects our d-pad and then it's kind of cool the guy i um, thought of this there's the two screw holes in the middle mm-hmm. and you drill those out and you put these little tiny buttons so it's LR that's buttons. cool that's cool because <laughs> that I, yeah. I was thinking i was like i saw the x uh x y a b and i was like oh that's cool I, i'm imagining the start and select of the trigger on the top yeah but, but there's a little cool l on the back that's so. cool yeah it's pretty cool i can't wait to have it done like hopefully next week i'll have it done What's whole, is it is it difficult to put together? Or? No, ones? like I said, I've been up till it's just time. Clock, yeah, it's time consuming. But I think I'm done with all the hard stuff. Now it's just I get the rest of the electronic components in on Monday. Hmm. So just today. a quick, quick question: Why wouldn't you just get like a Game Boy Advance and do it that way? Because there's already a right. No, I'm just saying oh, you like could use the it. screen, and, but you already have a right and a left. And um, all the, the Game Boy has like the perfect amount of space for the large amount battery. There's yeah. there's a power board. There's all these different stuff to make the original speaker and all that kind of stuff work. Original headphone jack. So there's a couple other components that I don't think would fit in a Game Boy Advance. Gotcha. I love that it's called a Game Boy Zero too. It's so yeah. cool. Zero. <laughs> Zero. Yeah. So yeah, if you're curious on building your own, you know, like I said, pseudo mod. Com. He has uh, all the different. He's on uh, part three of his guide. His forums there. All these people helping. It's, That's cool. It's really cool. What all else right. you doing, buddy? 
Oh, did you have something? You no, well, how many how many parts are there? He's only coming out with part three. Like, does he have it? Finished? Oh, it's like a twenty <laughs> I don't know, part, part series. No, he's finished his own, and then he's like building a second one and kind of leading people through it. Part three was putting the screen and mounting the screen and all that stuff. So, what if cool. he's just like, meh? I'm not gonna finish not gonna it. Do it. <laughs> you guys figure that would suck, but he's really cool. So <laughs> that's cool. Uh, what else have been doing? Uh, reading the new Star Wars novel. As always, came out. catching yeah, up Star on the Wars, canon. Uh, yeah, the canon Star Wars Bloodline. This is about Leia, right? This is all about Leia. It takes this takes place six years before the Force Awakens, um, and it's just kind of about her in the Senate um, and how she transitions into the Resistance as the leader of the Resistance. And supposedly, it's about how the First Order began. I'm not really there yet uh, about all that stuff. Is it good? Eh, it's pretty Sounds good. Kind of so far, it's got a lot of that Phantom Menace, like a lot of Senate <laughs> that's, stuff. That's, that's what I was saying. I was like, is not this necessarily trade negotiations, trade but there's definitely a lot of like Senate garbage and like political stuff. I'm just like, I don't really care. But apparently, the last half of the book gets real meaty and stuff. So I'm, I'm almost, I'm at that, I'm right about that point. But it is cool because like she make references to like uh, I was, I was hoping Ben or Luke would call because like he's out. Tr- ben is out training with Luke at during this point. Wait, what? Yeah, Ben. Ben Solo. Oh, well, you gotta be okay. I, we call him Kylo Ren, but yeah, go ahead, Ben Solo. I he got it. Kylo I, was I know he was about Ben Kenobi. That's what I thought. I'm oh, like, gotcha. wait, wait, is this like breaking all? Like, what's so going on? So, if you on? guys have never seen Force Awakens before and don't know the characters' names, okay, we get it. His name was Ben, and it was very touching in the all movie. Right. But it's, I, he's known as Kylo Ren. Yeah, um, at this point, it's Ben yeah, Solo, and he's be, out training really... with Luke Skywalker, and it's cool because like, uh, so like, she's trying to like, she's talking to him and Luke and stuff. Um, don't Han, spoil anything. I'm not okay. Han is out. Um, he has his own shipping company. Oh, he's like, she's on the main planet. That spoiler gets blown up in Force Awakens. Oh, yeah, uh, I don't mind you spoiling that part, but. Yeah, yeah so it's kind of cool, like, seeing the interaction between her and Han. They're still married at this point. Um, it's kind of cool. There's a point where she's like, oh, I just kind of want to quit and just, like, you know, do what you do, Han, and, like, just be with you and, like, travel around. And he manages, um, um, like, races, like, planetary races and stuff. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so he's I was gonna say, I thing. figured he did like a really mundane job, like a shipping job. Like he works at the Star, like Star Wars FedEx, and he's like hates his life and wants to <laughs> he go back. Owns to his own shipping company. Yeah, but yeah, it's really cool to see like the background stuff. So, like, so nothing crazy interesting yet. I'm really hoping. To Does get it to have something. a scene in there where like it's like Ben is like just like putting his hand through his hair? Yeah, he, he has <laughs> such nice hair. He's just like oh. no. Unfortunately, all the interactions with Ben or um, Luke is just like I hope I get a call from them, not like direct interaction. Oh, because they dropped him off at the at the Jedi yeah. training or whatever, right? Okay. Yeah. Are they just throwing in their names so that people like yes. go? Like, yeah, of course Ooh, they do. No, there is a flashback where like Han is holding Ben about. as a baby, and he's like, "Oh, I never thought I'd get older. Have a kid." It's it's cute. Do they like, make like little like nods like, "Hey, man!" Like the like, kid, little kid picks up like a sword, and he's like, "Hey, what are you doing? Why are you coming at me like that?" No, <laughs> like I said, it's all Leia's perspective. So like she has no idea what's going on with Ben or Luke. Or gotcha. Point. Okay. So do they talk about their other kid that they like abandoned on a planet? Ah, <laughs> I like that. You're up my uh, yeah. They, I, I doubt. I doubt there's going to be any crazy revelations in this book. Yeah, probably. They're going to save that for the movies. This is more for the nerds like me who like care about this backstory. And all Nerd that alert. Yeah, it's cool though. Uh, but also speaking of Disney, or excuse me, uh, Star Wars, you had something. You some news, right? With Disney. Yeah, Disney canceled uh, Disney Infinity, which kind of sucks. So you're yeah, not kind of. Well, I mean, were you still playing it? No. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Probably the problem. <laughs> no, it's just like with these collectible like plastic figures with Skylanders and then Disney Infinity's like, we want to get on that boat. And then I know Lego has Dimensions. Um, no, it almost I'd... feels like um, a Guitar Hero and Rock Band. Like it hit that critical mass of just plastic crap that everyone has to buy every year. Yeah. Um, it, Rock Band so... 4 came out and I didn't even, I want to. But... I mean, is it almost good for the collectors though who didn't like open the packaging? That's true. Now it's worth I mean, a lot cause, more. Yeah. Because yeah. they're not just going to keep making it. So... And the figures look really cool. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, I have right? a Hulkbuster one. It's so freaking cool looking. But um, the game itself is mediocre. I mean, even with even for kids, I guess it's probably more fun for them. But And is Skylanders right. doing well? I mean, is it just critical mass for all of them or... I have no idea. I'm sure Skylanders hit the decks when it was like Marvel. I can get Hawkeye or like Iron right. Man. Or Spyro or like, the Dragon. Yeah, yeah exactly. exactly. <laughs> like there's a zero. Yeah, but we're not interest. kids. So you, but yeah, you'd they're... be surprised what they think is cool. You know what I mean? What we thought was cool, our parents were like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> like our parents played yeah, with a pet rock. Come we on. didn't have these options, okay? Sure we did. We had Ninja Turtles and stuff like that. They just didn't yeah, play games with them. Ninja Turtle action figures. That's what I'm yeah, saying. We couldn't throw it into a Nintendo. Not yet. Well, have they... But see, that's the thing. With Ninja Turtles getting more popular, who owns that franchise? I th- Nickelodeon? I have no idea. I thought they had the Dimensions Ninja Turtles. I thought that was Oh, the Lego that. thing I or something? I think there was like a bunch of different... Well, Lego Lego is stuff. kind of weird. Like, Lego is able to navigate all of that stuff. I don't know what licensing deals they have, but, you know, they have like Batman in their 
We have Star Wars. Right, that's what I'm saying. Like they, they do a good games, job. Whoever's Rings, running Jurassic Lego. Park, yeah. They have all licensing for those games. The Lego stuff is even I was gonna say they've been building relationships. In uh, <laughs> building. Brick by brick. <laughs> <laughs> I love the Lego movie. That was like They're the gonna greatest. make a Batman one, right? Ah, yeah. The greatest. Even the trailers look great. Really? Yeah. Yeah, it was that was such a great Yeah, such movie. a great movie. No, 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 no. <laughs> Um, but uh, Disney, so they're not going to publish games anymore, right? Or just this well, game? Well, console games. They said they're not going to do console games anymore. They'll probably stick with the free-to-play mobile stuff because, of course, it's profitable. And they'll, um, they'll license, potentially, maybe. Yeah, I doubt anyone will pick it up, though. If it's not profitable, what other companies like, we want to make unprofitable toys and stuff. When they went to a yearly model, like they shot themselves in the foot because if you spend the 60 bucks for the base playset and game and then each figure is $15, and the next year they come out with a way cooler one, it's just... Right. <clears throat> Why? Why get it? It's, it's tough, man. Well, in that way, then maybe somebody could pick it up and just do a better job with it. Just maybe. only release them slowly in a Maybe every two years or something, something like that. that. Yeah, it's still disappointing that they're... I mean, this isn't the first time they've stopped making console games. The game I mean, after, like, the fiasco weak, with Epic Mickey and all that stuff, they stopped. They said they were going to stop making games. Well, yeah, with the, those were bad games. I mean, there's a good reason. The Epic Mickey games were... The first one was okay. Um, it makes me mad because remember those SNES Mickey games? I was just Magical thinking Quest? Super Nintendo had great Disney games. Lion King was awesome. Yeah, Aladdin, Aladdin was awesome. Aladdin was awesome. Well, it used to be licensed video games were terrible, and they've kind of movie video games. Yeah, I mean, like, like you they, don't see those very often anymore. N- well, yeah, I mean, there's a reason why. That was that was the exception of the rule. Then you had ten thousand crappy. They're horrible. Those yeah. games are horrible. Right. The only but, movie ones that are good are the Lego ones, honestly. Right, and they kind of take liberties. I mean, they they it's the same. It's not. I don't know. It, there, it's a Lego game. You know what I mean? It's a very simple. And I don't concept. know if you've seen the trailer for the Force Awakens ones, but it looks hilarious. Yeah, they, they, <laughs> I don't like the Lego games myself. My roommate used to always play them every single game, and it all looks the same to me. You're just clicking bricks. And you know what stuff. the greatest part about Lego games is when you get the two players, yeah. and they get too far apart, and it just splits the screen. And it's just like it's so simple. <laughs> yeah, but as a child, how many this? fights did you get in with people like wait, 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 go wait. left, go left? I'm stuck. Like you know what I mean? Like you could not go where you want to go, or they get you killed, or you fall off the screen, or whatever. It's like it's so simple. It's Lego. It was just like you got too far apart. I think I got in a You're fist a fight with one of my friends in, <laughs> in elementary school over the pizza and then and then Ninja Turtles game. Oh yeah, gotta, I I had less health and you have an extra life. Like why uh, would you not give me the pizza? That's, that's the and that's, he had like one tick away. He's like because I needed full health. No, you. Don't. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyways, um, it's a crime. So yeah, Disney make go back. Just just, just not go good. back to making good games. Make Aladdin HD. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Return to Jafar. Anything else? Nope. All right. You know what to do. Oh. Uh, <laughs> nope. Jordan, what you doing? I'll take it. I don't have much going on. All right. <laughs> this will be easy. <laughs> my life's full of children and uh, work and uh, not doing fun stuff. But 